That's the sound of the Long Lake wave slapping the rocks at the sandbar and grill. One of three stops during the eighth annual South Beach Triathlon. The race consists of biking, running and kayaking on one of the hottest days in Northeast Michigan. And athletes tried everything to stay cool. I got a nice pack in my bag. <laughs> Triathletes anxiously waited for 9 a.m. to begin the race. And they're off. 109 bikers begin their first trek from Long Lake Park to Maplewood Bar, a seven mile trip. Alpina sophomore and youth division champion Drew Seabase loved the biking. I think my uh, favorite portion was probably the bike because all the wind was just right in your face and it was really cool. Then racers jogged three miles to the sand barn grill before hopping into a kayak and taking off for the one mile distance across the lake. Matt France finished first with a time of 52 minutes and 49 seconds. But for one racer, his goal wasn't to finish first, out. but to beat his dad for the first time. Oh, I was so excited. I kept on looking over my shoulder to make sure he wasn't near me. And I mistaken his kayak for another, and I just kept going, going. The father and son duo have participated in the triathlon every year. It's a great bonding experience. It's just really great to see the community come out and have fun in an athletic event and really enjoy the park and all that Long Lake has to offer. The Long Lake Lights Festival ends with a bang. Fireworks light up the sky, but it wouldn't be possible without funding from the annual race. Find a biker, find a runner, find someone to kayak. That's what it's all about, is just teamwork and fun and yeah, it's local, which makes it even better. Competing, having fun, and giving back to the area is what the triathlon is all about. Thank you. WBKB Sports, Larissa Liska.